promote a place like this and to try and consolidate Division 3, you're, you know, you've got to have to, you know, you've got to have to pick between your teeth and the gumption in your brain to, to, to be ready for the battle. Um, the speed of the game goes up, the intensity of it goes up, and everything moves about it, you know, and we knew we were going to lie down, and they didn't. Don Bell have said at the end, they had one or two chances, so, and I know they, they lost a key player like Dean Healy, um, so look, um, yeah, I suppose we know we're bring it, which we're delighted, 2.19 is a bonus, really, like, you know, it's not about um, the score we got. I was pleased about the scores, I think we had 10 or 11 different scorers, and a lot from players, so. And great to get the lads off the bench on the, on the score sheet as well. Yeah, yeah, it's, a bit, it's been a difficult um, six or seven weeks for us all. Uh, and that just needs to be said. And, and even I talk to the manager level, they're all finding it. It's really cramped up on top of each other. And normally you'd have a tough team week, so leading, and lads get you get pre-season competitions or you get challenges, and lads it works it out. There was no challenge. We had one challenge lead up to. There was none during the week because you couldn't. You're trying to recover, trying to train, and lads know that there were only three three games and the season could be over like so they're worried about all this training and it's understandable from their point of view but it's been a really challenging six months and I'd be lying to myself if I didn't tell people that it's it's just been it's been horrible at parts um, and trying to help lads through it but today I might take a glass off it but I won't forget it the last four or five weeks it's, it's just the way the setup has been it's just the way that it's been really difficult and you're know, trying to keep people interested in playing ball and if you talk to every manager up and down the country they'll probably tell you the same thing Billy, here today you, you set the tone from the off um, with, with those couple of early scores and it, it seemed to, I suppose, it, it seemed to be the, the pattern of the game really from there on in. You, you took the game to him at, at all times. Yeah, look, we knew we had to. You, you're not going to come up here and defend and, and go. And, you know, that's the way they play football anyway. So you had to. Um, you know, I was pleased in the first half. Was we had, I know we had four wides, but two of them were passes. So we had about 14 shots and 11 scores. No, when I say shot, they had the pass over off the back post went over his head but I would consider that a scoring opportunity and Gordon and Tommy had a wide each so from 14 scoring opportunities we took 11 and that was pleasing and all of them were for player so that's that's you know you know then the lads are on, are on the groove and but that haven't played us nothing we were suddenly two points up at half time we kicked the last two points just before the half to go in and we were playing with that bit of a momentum we knew they'd go along into the foot forward in the second half you know so breaks and go anywhere off a of, of foot forward so they were really focused they were really pride themselves and um, it's a credit to them and I'm, I'm, I'm delighted for them because they're young men are trying to challenge themselves um, and they continue to do that and um, I think they the, the, the performance two years ago here was a completely uncharacteristic. You know, if you're back in most of my interviews, you'll have always heard me talking about the character of this group, and um, it continues to build. And look, we'll see what it goes from here. Now we know we're not here in Division Three. I want you to please God. Um, we know that Danny's departing in August, and um, that's the key book trying to get lads in and um, trying to evolve the group for the future as much as the here and now. And it's a balance and act, but thankfully. We're getting a lot of pressure off the bench onto the lads and then those lads outside the group trying to get in and it's it's positive for Limit football but not easy to go through. Um, but the two previous matches yeah like you had less kind of space as was at the back because they were playing division three while we were playing division four with us last year. Did you, did you feel today we got a bit more space because we were getting a defence that wasn't playing as high as, as high a level? Uh, I don't know, I, I don't know John, it's possible. I think um, Tip and well, roughly one more season campaigners. I think that might, I don't know really, like, but I think that definitely played into it. They were, you know, they, they you, you knew they were playing outside Division 4 for the last number of years and, like, often they left you and fought into the trap and they hit you. We had a lot of possession against Stafford, we turned over any amount of ball, um, we were caught off a long kick outs for scores. So we learned an awful lot in that game, but as a management group and as a bunch of players, and thankfully we brought it here today um, and we played ourselves to that. Now, that, the win was. The upside of it, but the reality was the lads were taking the lesson on boards, and that's the key to it. If you're learning the lessons, you have the chance, you know. Yeah. Billy, how do you look at a, a semi final now? Is it very much bonus territory for you, or you know, a, another game pre championship as well? Uh, well, I see it. I see it. Look, um, it's a game to take on. Uh, we're going to learn from it one way or the other. Um, that's for sure. Um, I don't know who we're playing. De Derry. We're playing Derry, right? So, look, we see how, how they are going and um, we take on the challenge. And we know what it takes to get up to the top in the Division 3 for, you know, ahead of next year and um, we don't go up. So, one way or the other, win or lose, we're going to learn.